Hi, this is David from Chunky Water Treatment. Today we have finished one project for seawater desalination system. This system capacity is 36 cubic meter per hour and customer is from Iran. They are using this system for resort, for irrigation, for drinking and also for swimming pool. Okay, now we introduce to you the system, what kind of design we did it, what kind of brand we use for the parts for the filtration, for the membrane, for the pump, all details we sit together. Let's go. In this system, we use self-cleaning filters. This filter capacity is 90 cubic meter per hour. After self-cleaning filter, the water is coming to our ultra filtration system. In this system, you can see that we are using powder coated frame. This frame is carbon steel. Outside is coated with powder and then also we use oven to a more better result. In this system, we have used 18 pieces ultra filtration membrane. This is our seawater desalination system, reverse osmosis circuit. In this project, we use LG seawater membrane. And then in this project, we use 54 pieces membrane. And then as you see here, there is a nine membrane housing and then each membrane housing has six membranes. Also, same feature has here, we are using special coating for the frame. Also in this project, we use for the pump, for high pressure pump and recovery energy device, Danfoss brand. When we are producing seawater desalination system, our first choice is Danfoss high pressure pump and Danfoss energy recovery system because we have made a lot of project and then we we are very satisfied also our customer is satisfied the result of Danfoss the high quality stability durability all of this kind of quality things Danfoss pumps give to us so mostly when we are producing for seawater desalination system we are using Danfoss pump and also in this project we are using duplex 2205 pipe and also this pipe coated with a powder and then also again baked in oven. So there is no any rust and corrosion problem on this pipe. In this project for the raw feeding pumps, for self-cleaning filters, for ultra filtration, and then also in the CIP system, we prefer CNP brands. And then now CNP is in the market, really becomes stronger and then quality is very good and then most of our projects, also our European and USA customers start preferring CMP brand a pump. Also, we are satisfied for, from the result. So in this project, we use CMP booster and feeding pumps. In this project, for the valve side, for the electrical valve, valve we prefer German Watton valve. Quality is very good and also we, we use this brand in most of our project and then we don't face any problem. So uh, in this project, we use again Watton electrical valve. Uh, this is our control uh, panel. From this control panel, all system, uh, self-cleaning this filter, ultra filtration, reverse osmosis, all feeding pumps we can control. So now we can show to you our control panel. Here you can see the flow diagram. And then from, from here, we automatically or manual operate all system. In Chanka, for the electrical parts, we are always using Schneider. And then for the PLC side, we always prefer Mitsubishi. And then for the driver side, depends on the customer. You can use Siemens, a Danfoss, ABB, or a very good brand like here, Tetran from China. And then here also another electrical uh, power inlet. And then we have soft starter and then all system control from here.